up, y'all? It's your favorite home girl. And today, you guys are going to react to Conor McGregor. Now, he about to um, verse Cowboy. My prediction, I think if Conor, if he come into the ring with a with a right state of mind, then I think he going to win, period. Long as he in that right state of mind. Because, you know, dude been making some mistakes. Dude been making some mistakes and, like, hitting the old man. Like, going in and tearing up people's buses. Like, dude been crazy. But people make mistakes and it's all good. We all humans, you know what I mean? But long as he come in with that mentality, like, I'm here to win. Let's get to it. Mind on it. I think Connor gonna win. Now, Cowboy, he has had some losses. But he also has some wins. Um, but I think I'm going with Connor. You guys let me know down in the comments. So, we gonna get into some Connor McGregor funniest moments. Uh, just show him some support and love. I thought, you know, he really don't need it. Bro, got support and love. So, um, yeah, yeah, yeah. Let's pick one. Conor McGregor's funniest moments. Let's get into it. Y'all let me know how y'all feel down in the comments. Let go. Say when the baby is due? Um, March, I think. Not March, is it? May. <laughs> is there any indication? Hey, is it? May? What the fuck? Sorry, it's not May, is it? It oh, was March. What the fuck? How close are you guys to each other right now? Like, could you reach out and swing at each other right now, Connor? No, he's hiding somewhere. Look at the walk. Look at the walk. Connor, you tweeted out with the video of that jump shot that your confidence comes from your big ball sack. Can you elaborate <laughs> on that? <laughs> Stupid ass. <laughs> oh, again, I, re I revert to my old friend, the truth. That's where my confidence comes from. <laughs> my big ball sack. <laughs> big balls. <laughs> oh, stop. I'm just motivated by movement and money, and the movement of money. Eddie said he was disappointed in the country of... Some money bag. What do you think about that? I don't give a fuck what Eddie says. <laughs> I don't give a fuck. Who gives a fuck? I run Seven. the OG. Oh. I'm a fucking pimp. Bruh. <laughs> you ain't no pimp, nigga. I ain't say pimp you niggas up in the ring. <laughs> he is savage. All right, my battery died. I gotta get my shit Fucking together. Guilty, I know. Mick. I'm without me. This whole fucking ship sink. You should be thankful too. You got a bigger check now than fighting Dos Anjos. Been a little penny check with that. My check, <laughs> my check. Don't talk about money, your bro. Don't talk. Uh, I could easily switch you up now and go put you back on that 20, 20 and 20 if you want. But all I want is a thank you or even a little dance. You're welcome. Even a little Bruh. dance. Dance for me, Nate. Dance for me. <laughs> and don't look me in the eye when you dance. Did it ever cross your mind to try and convince Conor to maybe uh, not take the fight this weekend and just be a chef? <laughs> <laughs> you did shave your head after your last fight. What does it signify? Well, it signifies nothing. I just okay. was looking in the mirror saying, I don't want to wake up. My hair is fucking <laughs> annoying me. I think would give you the hardest fight out of anybody on stage. Right here. This guy TKOs people. When I knock people out, they don't fucking move. Not... Who the fuck is that guy? Oh my god. I'm gonna talk about money because we are the business network and the the business of the Ooh. US is all that. I'll sort take of over stuff. from here, Nate. You can bounce. Yes. <laughs> take take a coffee break, Nate. And by coffee break I mean bring no. me my oh. coffee. You've been mentioning that Conor McGregor is not a championship fighter. Uh, he only has two to three rounds. Yet in your professional career, you've only went to the fifth round twice and lost one of them. What the fuck are you talking about? <laughs> That's the champ! I love That's the fucking champ right there! He has a soon and tell you everything with that. I love it. I love it. His no, question is, what are you talking about? shit? Nigga, Connor, you got the nerve to ask anybody why they talking shit, bruh. Connor McGregor is the most shit talker. But as long, as long as he know how to back it up, eh? Talk as much shit as you want. That's How the fuck you up there talking shit? Say it like it is, you're blessed. You're blessed that I chose you. He's say like you blessed. You're blessed that I chose to whoop your ass next. You say, say blessed, like niggas. Is. They want you to give us a quick count to ten, both of you gentlemen, if you don't mind, just if you wouldn't mind counting to ten. Nate, you want to count to five. <laughs> he said <Yeah>. ten. <laughs> count to five, Nate, will you, if you can. Okay, I'm you put that coffee. I ain't counting. How about and that? who do you put that coffee? 
I, I know, can talk money and numbers with you all day, this, lady. This, Send me a picture, see what you look like. No, no, no. Okay. To, and she no, probably did. I don't did. want to see the picture. Uh, two more <laughs> questions. Uh, Bruh. This is it. <laughs> hey, bitch blushing. Hell yeah, hear it die, so. Man, maybe that's a sign of things to come. What are you worth today? There's people. There's people buried in the desert for less than that, that you know. You're, you're, you must think I trust you or something with these kind of. Um, these kind of. How much are you worth? How much, how much are you on? What's your, what's your wage? What's your monthly wage? Uh, I asked the questions, and so I want to know. But Nate, Nate, well, I yes. also like to ask What questions. are your financial... Was there one moment where you even surprised yourself and said, damn it, I'm better than I thought I was? He said, hell no. I looked in the mirror this morning. I was like, damn, I'm better than I thought I was last night. What are your financial dreams? What, do you, what to you means you've made it? I don't know. <laughs> <He> <laughs> Say it like know. it is, Nate. Will you vote? Hey, I'm going to know when I make it, period. <laughs> Especially you come up from poorness, hey, you gonna know when you make it. <laughs> this the money channel? The <laughs> <laughs> I told you that to take five. Hey, only a broke motherfucker gonna get mad because you talking about money, bro. What is going on? <laughs> I told you to take five. <laughs> what was going through your mind watching Jose and, and Frankie? Because it looked like you were just on the edge of your seat there, ready to get back into the octagon immediately. I mean, no, edge of my seat, falling asleep. The last 20 seconds, I was screaming at both of them to fight. Really, the main thing to succeed in this game is to either be me or fight me. Everything else is peanuts. So ask Nate that. He knows that firsthand. I don't even know. I don't even. Damn, know. Nate. <laughs> <laughs> the dream fight. There, there isn't really. You know, I, I just, I'd love to fight myself if, if I really could. I mean, imagine the numbers that one would do if there was two of me. I feel Eddie. I've nothing against. Careful. Him. Be careful. I've nothing against Edward. Oh what? Oh what? Careful. What you gonna do? Oh what? You gonna do something over there? Be careful. Shut your fucking mouth. I just enjoy the conversations in the bank. The ladies at the bank, they treat me so damn nice. And, 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 and people everywhere treat you so damn nice. What did you think Take about Take them stupid ass glasses <laughs> off. Yeah. Make me. Make me. Shot fire. Make me. Make me. Make me. Fuck you! Oh yeah, it's time. Connor, don't throw those fucking hands. But y'all are getting the audience. Connor! Y'all know Connor a hot head. What did you think about Eddie's <laughs> fight against the Sonyas? This time, I'm preparing for a tall, lanky, ugly Mexican southpaw. Hey, the disrespect. I do really, really enjoy um, Vegas. I've buried the three bodies clean out here. Um, so Saturday night will be a fourth body. The, the dirt is... It's clean. You can scoop it up and stuff bodies in there easily. So I will continue to do that. Uh, Connor, can you tell us what you're going to do with the titles? Uh, Dana said today that you will keep the featherweight belt up until this fight. I'm going to wrap one on one shoulder. I'm going to wrap the other on the other shoulder. And you're going to need a fucking army to come take them belts off me. No one's going to be there. One's going to be there. I'm gonna be picking and choosing who I want to destroy next, and that's it. I'm a lion in there, and I'm Short gonna eat you alive. People. Your little gazelle friends are gonna be staring through the cage, looking at you, getting, getting your cock is getting eaten up. alive, and they can I'll do nothing. All, all they're gonna do is say, no "We're partners, never gonna yeah, cross this river again." <laughs> you know, most people when they get that red panty night on me, they ring home to their wife, "Baby, we did it." <laughs> Nate rings Nick, "Baby, we did it." As long as I have my belt at the end, how I look is, I, it, it's unimportant to me. How this guy looks is very important to him. Hey, Luke, damn right. That my socks were more than your whole suit you had on, you little bum. Disrespect, you bro. bro. I'll gut you like a fish, you <laughs> tick. 170 was my call. The next day I said, you know, nothing's no, 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 changed. No, no. You, you guys want to call back. You, you don't make any calls. You only answer the call. Don't act like it was your call, motherfucker. <laughs> I'm calling that shot. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, no, no shots, Nate. Let's, let's, let's be honest here. They all have sore vaginas lately. It's crazy. There's something going on. I don't know. Bosanios broke his foot and his vagina <laughs> in the same damn day. And same with, same with Edgar. Imagine getting the biggest fight in the history of the game and saying, shut your mouth, kid. You're getting paid what you got your last fight. And you're lucky you're even getting that. Yes, sir. And sign it. 
I wasn't gonna, I was gonna negotiate the money. Because no. this guy, no he's, he's an author. He's an author of a book. Best selling book. We do it all. <laughs> we do it all. It's a best seller. He Can said, I we do it all. Connor, there used to be a very large poster of um, Floyd Mayweather on the front of the MGM Grand. The I might go up there and rip it down myself. And what's he gonna do about it? What's he gonna do? He can do nothing. Did you ever move up to welterweight and try and get a third belt, if you could? All the belts. Hey, <laughs> Connor is savage though. He fucking savage. Hey, you guys let me know how you guys feel about him. We're going to get some more, y'all. Um, let me know your prediction, who you guys think going to win. Um, I just think Connor, he might end it with a KO. Unless Cowboy, like, get him on the ground. You know, and put him in one of them moves. I don't know. He might kill me. I don't know. Y'all let me know down in the comments. Let's go.